Hey guys, Davison here. So how would you feel if you were judged extremely harshly for one answer to one very awkward question by millions of people? Because that's what happened to Miss Utah at the 2013 Miss USA pageant. She was asked a very complicated, awkwardly worded, worded question about the wage gap and what that says about society. <laughs> not, not, a, not any society, specifically just society. So I'll read the question to you and then I will ask you to think about whether or not you could have answered that question diplomatically in 30 seconds while looking beautiful and smiling appealingly at the judges with your flawless lip gloss, which that is not a dig, that is not a dig at her. That is not a dig at her. The question from Nini went like this. A recent report shows that in 40% of American families with children, women are the primary earners, yet they continue to earn less than men. What does this say about society? <laughs> Whenever I read questions about society, it makes me think about social studies class because they're so broad and juvenile that it's very difficult to take them seriously those kinds of questions so what they wanted to ask basically was what do you think about the fact that women still earn less than men despite being the primary earners in their household I think I mean and then applying that to society is a whole other thing and you know we all know the answer to that unfortunately we live in a society that is still sexist and in a society where women are taught to be kind and subservient therefore they do not ask to be paid the same as men there are some improvements that have been made in the past decade to wage parity however we're still not there yet and if anything women being the top earners in their household 40% of the time illustrates the fact that probably less high paying jobs are available than in the past because these women ostensibly are earning less than their male partners if they're in a heterosexual relationship therefore it must indicate that our economy is not doing as well and that, that could circle the question back to society as was asked originally so all this to say is that the backlash against her is what is the most interesting part of all of this like I said when I opened this piece can you imagine if you were put in front of thousands of people and you knew your success at something dependent on your one answer and you didn't know what the question was going to be and then something very complicated was thrown at you you would you would probably choke too and the fact that people are judging her so harshly shows how sexist and judgmental and misogynistic online culture has become which may be reflective entirely of our society I think it's appalling that people are commenting on her looks being evidence as or evidence of the fact that she must be less intelligent than the average woman. That's not true. Beauty is not inversely proportionate to intelligence or vice versa. So that's that. That's my reaction. And um, I, I don't know what to say. It just it, it makes me feel tired and sad. And this, I mean, this woman willingly put herself into a pageant, but she, she's honestly, she's there to be the product of a, success, a sexist society, not to rail against it. 